Hi there, this is Saltiness Isn't Bliss. On tonight's episode, I'm gonna show you just a quick and easy way to make a scrambled egg and to keep the sodium level low. So I've got my little egg pan here that I love, use this all the time. And I'm just gonna feature one egg. Of course, you can use as many eggs as you like. Um, there is about 70 milligrams of sodium per egg. So just keep that in mind. So we're gonna start by breaking our egg and putting it directly in the pan. Okay, so we have just put our egg in our pan and next I'm gonna add some olive oil. All of the ingredients we are putting in there are to taste and are to um, however thick or thin, fluffy or non-fluffy you want your egg. So I just kinda eyeball everything. Of course, as always, I'll put some measurements down below as a guideline. Next, I use half and half. Half and half is a great alternative to milk. A lot less salt in it. And then I just sprinkle in a lot of great um, salt-free uh, ingredients. So I start with some dried oregano. Next, I add some dried parsley flakes. Fresh herbs, as always, would be great in here as well and would add a real strong uh, flavor. Some fresh cracked pepper. As always, any pepper will work. You can always go with a spicier pepper too if you wanna add a little spice to your egg. And my last seasoning will be some garlic powder. This comes out really quick, so I'm just gonna Use my fingers to put just a tiny bit in there. And onto my cheese. I like to put a couple different cheeses, and again, I keep it um, pretty minimal just to keep the salt level low. So I'm gonna start with a shredded uh, cheddar cheese. And then on top of that, a little bit of shredded Parmesan. All right, so we've got all our ingredients in the pan. I'm gonna turn the burner just below high. This will cook very quickly. Um, so now I'm just going to kind of break up the yolk in the egg and kind of mix my ingredients as best I can. And then I'll just kind of keep a close eye and continue mixing as this starts to cook. Okay guys, so after just about a minute, minute and a half, here's where we're at. So this cooks up very quickly. Like I said, I started just below high. Now I've got it just above low. Um, and at this point, it will all depend upon how fluffy or runny you want your scrambled egg to when it will actually be done and ready to come out. But I would say in just a few seconds here, I am good to go. So I'm gonna turn my burner off. At the end, if you wanna to top it with any additional spices or cheese, feel free. I am gonna just pour that directly into a dish here. There it is. So yeah, I'm one of those, oh, got a little bit on the stove there want to miss any of it. I'm one of those weird people that is not big into breakfast so I usually actually make this for lunch or dinner or to accompany my lunch or my dinner um, so that is what I am doing tonight. So thanks for joining me in the kitchen. I will see you next time.